What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. How many of you brothers are from the African-American community like me? Because I am from the black community. Where I grew up in the black church. I know all about the Saturday fresh fries. I know all about the hooping and hollering. I know about crackheads. My dad was one. But I also know about pookies and ray rays. All right. And I don't know about you, brothers. I was a, you know, funny kid, uh, you know, a nerd a little bit, jokester. I, I, I wasn't a tough kid. I mean, don't get me wrong. I will fight, win or lose. But I wasn't a, I wasn't a gangster. You know, I wasn't a thug. And I had no real aspirations of doing that. I wanted to work and I wanted to do what I'm doing now. Not a YouTuber, but I wanted to do something like that with my life. But I did notice that athletes and pookies in the black community got a lot of the women to do things that normal guys like us couldn't get them to do now it could be just because we just didn't have no game all right and uh shout out to simple to p he said something very profound one day he said you know it's not that the pimping or pookies you know got women it's just that the women like them so if a woman like you, it don't matter what you do. You don't, you don't have to be a gang member or a dope dealer. But for whatever reason, these guys have a little bit more of a social advantage. They, they spend their time, you know, talking to ladies and all that other stuff and whatever the case may be. And I would always wonder, why is it when every time one of these people go to jail or go to prison, they got one of these fine ass chicks with them that's like, doing the long haul like prison wife right and it's so bad i've seen this even on tiktok where you have chicks who are literally waiting on a dude to come home i i know you don't believe me let's check out some clips hey girl i don't know who you think i am but i cannot go to the prison and tell them to let my husband out they're gonna tell me to go to hell just like i'm about to tell you right now to go to hell because i don't know who the hell you think you're talking to anyway Stop trying to save my husband from me. He don't want to be saved. You don't know him. You don't know what he feeling. You don't know what he got going on. We all know he want to get out of prison. We want him to get out of prison. But are you going to go break him out for real? Like, you go out there and break him out. You go break him out You and you bring him to me. Thank you. And unfortunately for you, this is not a democracy. You don't get to have no opinion on my page. If I say the sky is purple and you come on here and tell me the sky is blue, you're getting out of here. Period. <laughs> Bye. Now... <laughs> This is a lady you would feel, hey, you know, she, she, you know, she a little, she a little hood and everything, but not bad looking. She should be able to get a dude that's not in jail. Well, and then they be having them hold them down. They be having other chicks cheating on them with other chicks. Um, I mean, just it's just crazy, right? But now, Tory Lane, who is from Canada, who ain't even from the states who was getting into all kind of trouble in the States, had every reason to be successful. This nigga got his ass locked up, okay? Then his baby mama, who he really didn't want to be married to when he was free, because he was clapping all the cheeks up. Before he went to the, do his little bid in prison, he said, listen, why don't you marry me? Raina Chisange, whatever her name was. You know how women are in the heat of the moment. Yeah, we're going to work this out. I'm going to be there with you. Shit. That fool ain't been in there for a whole year. Her ass is gone. She filed divorce last week, citing irreconcilable differences. You know what that means? I'm going to tell you what it means. If you really want to know. I'm going to tell you what it means. It means that your ass ain't shit no more and you ain't got no money you ain't got no clout you can't do nothing for her in there and she can't go pay no bills with the fact that her baby daddy tory lane got clout in prison she can't use that no more so now your ass is gone it's over you thought you was somebody Nah, man, she gonna get you up out of there, bro. Your ass is out. And that's what's gonna happen. And you wanna know who might be in there clapping some cheeks like that? Man, somebody like me. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm gonna be real, I'm gonna be real, I'm gonna be real, I'm gonna be real. You see, 
being a nerd, man, you always got something popping when you stable. And this is what I want to tell some of the young guys out there, man. A lot of the young brothers, you're trying to impress somebody. You know, you ain't got it right now. These pookies got it right now. D -d -d Don't worry about that. They not going to keep it, though. <laughs> they, they not going to keep it, bro. They not going to keep it at all. No, they not. They won't. They will not keep it at all. And as soon as they get their ass in the trouble and they can't provide, right? Some of them chicks will stay, but not for long. And even if they are staying, they basically going to get clapped up while they in jail. Because now a woman got to depend on them. I'm going to tell you, man, a, a, a woman can't respect that. You know, you a man, you've been taking care of her. You've been holding her down. You've been doing all of this and that. And, 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 and now you can't, you in jail, you in prison. Why, why am I dealing with you then? What's the whole point? But you know, you ain't even a tough guy no more. Now you in the pen. And I want everybody to know that, man. Being a tough guy don't pay. Being a smart guy pays. Being a smart, I know a lot of dudes, man. When I was coming up in the early 90s and late 90s, man, dudes had it all, man. Now in our 40s, them dudes can't do nothing. Man, they ain't got nothing popping. They don't have anything popping, bro. I'm just gonna be real with you. They don't have anything going on right now in their life. No money, no, no way to get money, no businesses, nothing. Right, and these women, they 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 wanted to be with them. At least her, she getting out before it's too late. Cause he didn't really want you no way, boo. He would have want you. He to marry your ass before he went to prison. Then you could have held him down. He didn't want you. So before you guys make a stupid ass mistake and you expected somebody to hold you down when you go to jail, listen, man. I I I I, I got a I got many family members in jail, man. Uh, one of them is a really good cousin of mine. You know, like I said, he needs something, I always help him out. But you'd be surprised how folks turn on you when you ain't got nothing, when you ain't popping no more, when you ain't hot. Oh yeah, they with you when you're spending money. Oh yeah, they with you when you got things cracking. Oh, they definitely there with you. But 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 when when things is going wrong, oh, they not there no more. They ain't there no more. They not there no more. Why they not there? Why is that? Why is that? I wanna know. Does it make any God damn sense. Now, I I, 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 I just want you brothers to, to keep on believing that, understanding as a man, your value is gonna be always attached to what you can do for somebody. Long as you know that, you'll be all right. But you gotta know that. If you don't know it, it it's, 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 you're, gonna, you're, gonna, you're gonna end up being mad. You're gonna end up being pissed off. You're gonna end up being you know upset at the whole world. And the world works like that, man. Once you can't give these chicks nothing or can't give nobody else nothing, they ain't you no more. Just understand that's how it works. And the more you understand that's how it works, the better you are able to deal with it. And the more you cannot take those stupid ass risks like illegal stuff and you know where your ass gotta go to jail and can't nobody help you. Cause once you go, hey, hey, bro, ain't no matter what you did for folks, they not gonna be there, bro. People out there to get what they can get. Now, Tory Lanez, he gonna find out who really down for him. Not much. The whole, your whole world can change like that in just a day. So guys, what do you think? It's your boy O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Drunk. Appreciate you for all that you just heard the bell. We're out.